winning. <laughs> This week we've been putting you on the standby list to win your way out of winter every Friday. We're calling a winner and sending them somewhere fabulous and tropical. Tell them about the prize, son, and I'll dial the number. All right, you in flights. It looks incredible. Three. All on ground transfers, spending yeah. money. It's an incredible prize. I think we got it. Right. I like this bit. I like this bit. Hello, is that Lisa from Camden South? Oh my God, Jonesy, yes it is. I only have one thing to say to you. Oh my God, thank you so much. You don't know the months I've had. This is oh. just unbelievable. Oh, <laughs> great, Lisa. Set flights, ground transfers, spending money. You'll have the time of your life, and it sounds like it's come just in time. Yeah? Nothing to do but lay beside the pool with a nice tusk of beer and just enjoying <laughs> Nao Rake. You might be able to see him perform. I'd love a cocktail by a pool. Well, Lisa, it sounds like you are so deserving of this. Congratulations. Thank you so, so much, guys. I love you so much. We love you, Lisa. Good on you. Come fly with me. Let's fly, let's fly away. If you can use some exotic booze, there's a bar in Far Bombay. I'll come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. We're going to bed. How do you say Anik? Come on, fly with me, let's float down to Peru. In Lama Land, there's a one man band, and he'll toot this flute for you. Come fly with me, let's take off in the blue. Once I get you up there Where the air is rarefied We'll glide Start just rum, say rum, rum. Here we come And we'll beat those birds down to Acapulco Bay It's too perfect for a fly in the honey Ooh, oh babe so come fly with me, let's fly, we'll fly Pack up, let's fly away
Oh, that's Panda Colada. Does it, does it sound like anything? Panda Colada. Oh my god. I don't know what number cocktail this is, but this is a Midori sunset. Our mission is to convince mum and dad to let us move to a place where we can do this every day because we do not want to leave just yet do we Paul? Yeah. You won't leave. We only just arrived yesterday. We, we, have, we don't want to leave. We have plenty of stuff to do. <laughs> but I just still don't want to leave here. It's too busy. This is my happy place. I'm gonna holiday here when I grow up. See. <laughs> As she walked in the place, I knew her smile in an instant. I knew the curve of her face. It was my own loving lady. And I said, Oh, it's you. Then we laughed for a moment. I said, I never knew that you liked pina coladas. I'm getting caught in the rain. We are not coming home. Sorry, family. <laughs> I had a mate of mine on our travels say that, uh, you know, I think it'd be a great idea if we did this full time. And, uh, seriously thinking about it, eh? Yes, I like pina colada. We're off on a little adventure today. Uh, when I came to Plantation Island, I swore if I had to swim there, we were going to get to Modriki Island as part of our tour. Unfortunately, none of the uh, commercial charters will take you to Modriki Island at the moment because they're filming an episode of Survivor, so you can't get there. That'd be cool. So we've had to pay a local. It'll take us in there in his own boat. Uh, why do I want to go there so much? Well, it's where the movie Castaway was filmed with Tom Hanks. Now, in the Fuji Islands cluster, there is an island called Castaway Island, which people mistakenly think it's the movie island, but it's not. The correct island that was used for the making of Castaway was Madriki. Madriki uh, Island. Shot back with Tom Hanks in the year 2000. All those 23 years ago. Yes, it really has been that long. So, We'll find this local fellow and, yes, and, uh, and we're bringing a special guest onto the island. We are, actually. And yeah. he's actually one of, the, one of the characters in the movie. Trust us to do something like that. Before heading out to Madriki Island, Sam, our guide, took us to Suluvu Island, where a traditional village still remains. 
We met the village chief, who welcomed us with some sort of ceremony and drink. Hello, hola. Yeah. Hola. This is so, so foreign surreal. to us, isn't it? This is really surreal. Oh my god. Oh, Chloe, look. This is your year. Hola. I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Wanna come up and say hello, Chloe? Then we walked around the village and met some of the school kids during their class time. A lot of the kids that were my age didn't even have shoes, but they were very friendly. How's school? Good. This is this is Chloe. She's nine. How, how old are you? Um, seven. Seven. How old are you? Me seven. Seven. There you go. Chloe, I'm Jess. Can my girls get a photo with you? Yes. Moving. Sorry. Go in. There you go. Chloe and Jess, come on. There you go. Say bula. 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 Wave to the camera. Wave to the camera. That's nice, kids. Thank you. That's a nice photo. Oh. Bula. Bula. <laughs> And you're a school teacher? I'm a school teacher. I'm a Mr. Rica. I'm a teaching year two. And there's 22, uh, I have 22 uh, kids. Uh, and myself, I'm from the interior that's in the Highland. Uh, this is not my place. Coming to Inmalo, like uh, this is the first time for me to come here, coming by boat. What a wonderful story. And you're actually a happy school teacher. I'm happy to be a school teacher. <laughs> And I love staying with the kids. Oh, you've got a beautiful culture. Well, and you too as well. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank nice you so much. Hello. You. you too. How's the school teacher going? Good. Do you like it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Good on you. Alright. See you kids. Hola. Hola. And there you go. That's how they do it in Fiji. Hola. <laughs> The people are beautiful here. They're another one of these cultures that own very little, but seem to be the happiest out of anybody I know. They own nothing, but in a way they really have everything. It seems the less you own, the happier you are. And there just might be something in that. Out of all of our travels that our family have done together, this has to be one of the most fascinating experiences that we've shared. And there she was, Madriki Island, just one of the 333 islands here in Fiji. Hollywood aside, if you were ever marooned, on a deserted island, this would be the place to do it.
What are you doing, Chloe? Trying to crack open a coconut. Is it working? No. Why? Because it's hard. It's too hard on the rocks. You can't get it smashed open. What if you were on a deserted island, you had to get that coconut open for food? I don't know what, what I would do. Tom Hanks made it look easy. Jeez, they're a tough thing. Yeah. Well, that looks a good idea. That's barely even doing anything. <laughs> <Come on. laughs> this is the kind of scene that you see in a movie before a big, they get hit by a big cyclone. Oh, yes. And then they all have to evacuate the island. I think the party's nearly over, folks. If this All hits right. us... Just a kind reminder, everybody, you hear the thunder, but then there's also lightning eh, before the thunder, so be careful. Yep. Find yep. somewhere you're safe. Exactly. Maybe another hour we'll have rain and thunder. So there's going to be a lightning storm coming over. He's just warning everyone that's in the water to be careful. Did you hear that, Lisa? Rain and thunder in the next hour so and make yourself safe. So everyone in the water be careful. So Lisa went and got in the in water. Because we're Aussies, mate, that's how we run. Guys, we're not we're not afraid of electrical lightning hey, storms in the water. I'm excited. Fooey. <laughs> so I didn't Well, it's here, everybody, go find shelter. You're gonna get fly on. Rain, more rain, more rain. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't go around us, guys. It's gonna come right through this resort. So, uh, we are going to move on. Oh. We got 15 minutes, big showers, lightning, and very, very frightening thunder. So if you can get yourself in the shelter, please go shelter. If not, you can weather it out in the sea. Fire, 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 lightning.
So last night, massive storm. Started at dinner time, was pouring rain throughout the night. It was torrential rain. We've woke up this morning where it seems like we're disconnected from the mainland. Our boat that's meant to get us back home over to the mainland on Saturday. Did not survive the storm. Didn't survive. So we might have to stay here a bit longer. What a shame. I'll just see if it's safe, okay? Turn right. Turn right. What's that? I don't like this. Hey, look, it's the toilets. Yep. I'll show you to walk. Engine room. Half the engine's pulled out. Right. Was last certified in 2003. Ooh, yeah, it's seen better days. Other engine. Ooh, that's gone too. If only the walls could talk. Imagine all the passengers here. Like that. The vines won't hurt you. Oh my gosh, it's so overgrown. There you go. Ew, is this the yeah. bed? A bit more cross it. Bit creepy. A bit. <laughs> See, it's funny. Even though we are on a tropical resort, and I do love it, don't get me wrong. But all these side shows that you come across, hiking, abandoned things, it's interesting. You're right. Yeah. Pardon the pun, guys, but the time has come to really abandon ship. Uh -huh. Knee slapper. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Uh -huh. Ow, I'm gonna get a wedgie. Damn. Oh, oh. Good. Huh. Delayed. Come on, me want to go home. Dead, me said, dead, me said, dead, me said, dead, me said, dead. This is the nicest hey, caravan park I've ever seen. Man, <laughs> Work on nights on a drinker run. How are you feeling, Chloe? Hot. <laughs> Look out there. I don't know if that's where we turn right to come down here or whether we're in rugby fields. If we just keep walking along, you'll end up back there. Oh my god! Six foot! Seven foot, eight foot boats. Delay, come on, we want to go. Well, this is something familiar to us, even though we've never been here. Bushwalking through the wilderness. Even in Fiji, you can find the best places to uh, move your legs. This is fantastic. We actually need to walk off breakfast, so we asked, "Where's the biggest hill?" Apparently, it's this way.
That's it for us. See you back on the red dirt. <laughs> Isale is a famous Fijian farewell song. It depicts many meanings. It means love, joy, beauty, and sorrow. Many farewell songs have been composed throughout the Fiji Islands, but none so far comes close to our dear Isale. So as we sing to you from the bottom of our hearts, we mean farewell, bon voyage, and a safe trip back home. We made it. We made it. We made it. Got the window seat, Jess. Oh. Oh. Wait. Do you know what we forgot? <laughs>